Hi, Monica. Monica wanted me to show you their collar that Lily has. The thing you need to note is that there are two hooks here. If you take her for a walk, you need to put the clasp, hook it over both of them. If you only do it one, this is a quick release collar. It's so if she got stuck somewhere, she wouldn't strangle. It would actually just break on her. And so if you had it only hooked with one of the clasps, and she pulled really hard, she could get away. So whenever you uh, take I'll just push it back together here. Thank you, you put, yeah, there we go. And so, uh, so yeah. anyway, just, you need to hook them both. That's all, if you have your leash, just hook it over both, you'll be fine. You wanna show the yellow, the yellow tag for the, uh... yeah, see? Okay, this is her um, harness for, uh, if you go, for riding a car, it's a, so it's her seat belt. It looks kind of weird. How does that work? How it works is this part goes in her on her chest. So I'm just going to put it down on her chest, and I'm holding the two sides here. I just come up, hook those around her, back, done. This is obviously the hook that's going to ride on her back. Now you can pretty much figure out since there's a loop there. I just need to put her foot through it. I put her foot through it. And there's the other clip, and it just clips in the back. There, she is now ready to go. So there's a strap between her legs, and then behind each leg. And then this one goes around her neck, as you can see. Right there, come right there. So there you go. Then just hook a carabiner here. We'll put one on for you. Here, and then you can just hook that onto a seat belt. Nice and safe. Yeah, so you, you close the seat belt, and then you attach it to the seat belt, because there's yeah. a little bit of room to not be like totally stuck against the chair. Mm -hmm. And she has to have it on to keep her safe while riding in the car.